When in despair or lack of social ties, I fill the air with sad and lonely sighs, yearning for the sight of friendly face, I realize that I know just the place. I know how to fill my lonely room, or at least my laptop screen, by Zoom. Just click my mouse on Tikbot Israel's link, and quicker than an octopus can blink, I with my fellow congregants can gather to pray and after schmooze a bit together. When 8 a.m. tomorrow, early riser, and those who are still in bed are none the wiser. I need just two more lines to end this sonnet, and look at that, it seems I've gone and done it. And now Dr. Zeus. Friday morn, where shall we pray? In a one-horse open sleigh? Hold our minion in a well or with the farmer in the dell? Could we have it on a train or on that rainy plain in Spain? Dovin on a field of battle or in a pasture full of cattle? In a downpour or a trickle while we munch upon a pickle? Or a ship out on the sea or with a leopard in a tree? That doesn't sound too safe to me. Say, maybe in a royal Paris or in, Aurora, or in Aurora Borealis? Could we daven in my room? Could we daven in a womb? Neither. They'd be much too crowded, even if CDC allowed it. No, let's all daven using Zoom. And after all our prayers are over, the Prophet Shmuel we will cover. Haftorah study starts at 9, and we'll examine every line. Rabbi Israel will lead it, so don't waste time. Sit down and read it.